home prices rise at the fastest pace in more than six years. Florida's housing market sees strong gains in December despite the pandemic, and 2020 existing home sales hit a 14-year high. These are three headlines that are just a few of today's top stories. And it's good news for our economy and for our real estate market here in Florida. Hi, my name is Kim Dowling and every month we like to do a deep dive here at Coastal into the real estate market to bring you the numbers that directly impact your home value. So let's get started. Now you've heard it before and the fourth quarter of 2020 remained true to the continued dynamic of fewer homeowners putting their house up for sale. It's keeping our inventory levels at roughly half of what they were a year ago. As we move into the first half of 2021, these low inventory levels will create a highly competitive market for buyers. And buyers, you're going to need to have some patience and you'll want to be ready to move quickly. Sellers, you continue to be in a very strong position of pulling top dollar out of your home while selling faster than we typically see. With that being said, sellers, you're going to have to be really smart about your sales price. Not every house is selling, and it's a magic formula of strategic marketing that will bring top dollar. And buyers, it's important to work with a team that knows how to find you the perfect property and knows how to write a winning offer. You may have heard that there are no houses to buy, and that's simply not true. We are putting homes under contract for our buyers each and every week, and we will find you your dream home. Our agents are able to help both buyers and sellers take every single advantage that this market has to offer. And as you think through all of your different options, let's take a look at the numbers that will help you make the most informed decision about your real estate needs moving forward. Within our MLS coverage area, the number of listings sold in December increased by 12% month over month, and we are 16% up year over year. Total sales volume increased by 13%, and the average sales price rose slightly by 1%. But here's the number that increases your home value. The average sales price is 16% higher than one year ago. Home prices are rising at the fastest pace in more than six years, and in 2020, home price increases hit a 14-year high. Here in Florida, almost 1,000 buyers are relocating to our state every single day. We're only second in the entire nation to Texas. And these sales prices are driven by families demanding more living space. I know here in our community, working with all of our wonderful clients and our neighbors, the consensus is that we are going to continue to stick closer to home again this year. For every other statistic that we like to track, we saw a drop last month. Active listings on the market dropped by 9%. New listings hitting the market dropped by 13%. And residential homes going under contract dropped by 7%. So our monthly inventory is sitting at less than two months and our average days on market is 42 days, down from 58 days this time last year. It's all good news for homeowners and for the real estate market we're going to continue this wild ride here into 2021 and we are grateful to start off on a high note. We are going to continue to work hard for you and I'll be back next month to let you know how we wrapped up January. Sellers, we're going to help you get the most value out of your home every single dollar and buyers, we're going to make sure that you are prepared to move quickly and we will give you the competitive edge over other would be buyers when we find you that perfect home. Our team has decades of experience to craft the most attractive offers for you to win. So stay well and we wish you and your family all the best. We are a phone call away when we can be of service.